So I have a quick video for you today. I'm out in the woods and I'm cooking up some late lunch this afternoon and I'm also recording a video review for a product known as the Chef's Temp Final Touch X10, a digital thermometer. And I just thought you might be interested in seeing the setup that I'm using. So I have my Firebox Freestyle set up here on the ground and underneath the Firebox Freestyle, I do have a fiberglass mat because of course I am on the forest floor and I'm just being extra cautious, but I'm also using Using the coffee spit to suspend what is about a three quarter pound pork loin there and then I have a windscreen wrapped around the outside. Now the idea here is I'm building on something that Steve Despain did recently in one of his trips out to the woods where he cooked a steak off of the side of his uh, stove and it occurred to me that this is a great way to roast something so that you can see the flames are not directly touching. They may look like it in the camera, but they're not directly touching the meat. So they're just outside of the reach of the flames, but they are getting radiant heat from the flames and from the stove itself. So as the, ste the stove itself heats up and radiates out the back, that heat is being captured by the windscreen there, and it can only go in one place, which is up. So it not only is the piece of meat being received heat directly from the front as you see it but it's also receiving heat underneath as well now to adjust it the uh, the amount of heat is there's a couple things of course is to work with the wood how much wood you're actually going to be adding to the fire and I'm using split hardwood uh, but I can also move the stove back and forth so if I think the flames are getting too intense I just grab the pan that the freestyle is sitting in and just pull it back a little bit away from the meat but right now it's working out perfectly well ideal i'm really quite happy the way this is working out so that coffee spit is quite quite the thing it's first time i've used it out here in the woods and it's working out well using the freestyle in the bushcraft six configuration six-sided uh, rectangle all right watch for the review on the chef's temp final touch x10 and uh, have a good day